one point three. We're back to business as usual. We're not taking any calls as the segment is over. We'll continue next week Saturday. This morning, we'll be looking at maximizing our communication skills. This is 2022, the year of our Lord, like they say. Um, so a backstory when I had them, Amarachi. Uh, Amarachi, sorry. <laughs> when I had Amarachi, I was talking about um, innovation skills for business. Um, she posted me on linkedin because i like to hide <laughs> i really like to hide and um, um this wonderful lady reached out to us and, and she was persistent <laughs> she got my attention so i said okay fine she's she's um okay uh wait it's one page profile but you know how what she does it we take paragraph one and paragraph last paragraph um she's a communications trainer a speaker advice so and multi award multi award winning blogger she's also the best selling author of the business communication blueprint influence and tribe how professionals how professionals entrepreneurs business leaders and corporations use effective communications to get results she helps them um, professionals entrepreneurs and business leaders to improve their communication skills so they apply their they amplify their influence and tribe in their fields back down uh, because it's plenty <laughs> Um, she delivers highly rated bespoke in person and virtual communication programs and virtual services through her company. Her clients include all of them inside. Um, so I have with me Lucille Osai. Hello, hello, thank you very much. <laughs> it's a pleasure to be here today. Okay, then. Um, communication is how we connect with others, it's how we express our thoughts, feelings, and ideas to the people around us, and it's also how we come to understand them this morning. You'll be helping us to understand and maximize our communication because like we're having i overheard the conversation you were having with your lovely husband who's here with us in the studio and um we're talking about manners we're talking about a lot of things yeah. but this is my very first question they say communication is a two-way street mm -hmm. and a lot sometimes a lot most times not sometimes a lot most times mm -hmm. is um, missing and how then do we balance the communication a two-way street okay so by being very clear about what we want to communicate the message we want to pass across mm -hmm. yeah so there is usually a goal for your communication whether you want to introduce your business you want to get more information or you want to collaborate whatever your goal is you have to speak slowly if it's in an oral communication and make sure that you are clear enough for the other person to understand what it is you're saying and then ask questions basically <laughs> communication so okay for you well, okay. let's back 